it used to be that uh, organizations really owned and controlled everything. And now that they're so much more dependent on external applications and services and networks, the service assurance has to evolve to also give visibility into those domains. And it's not just about visibility anymore. You need to understand the context of whether issues that are in the network or issues that are in the application are impacting user experience. You have to pay attention to how are you going to manage all of this, right? How are you going to do threat detection and response? How are you going to do service assurance, right? How are you going to keep up everything in a way that you are always up to date? So the focus on service assurance becomes even more important all the promises around 5G are rotating around high quality services. So of course this is connected to networks becoming super critical when it comes to performance. The 5G changes the landscape. The quality of service is getting even more important and there are several hurdles. But we believe there's a better way and that is by active monitoring, which means that we install hundreds or thousands of active test agents throughout the network and by doing that we will get a very precise measurement and view about the kpis in the network this is the new business world of hey wait a minute i'm i'm, I'm in a hybrid environment i have people that are working or flexible and remote um, the idea of acquiring services into the cloud it raises a really interesting question about where is the boundary of where a managed service provider, a carrier like us who provides managed services, starts and stops with respect to the cloud service. What is important is consistent customer experience. That coupled with the ability to have control and visibility across the entire enterprise domain is what ultimately encapsulates service assurance. I'd like to ask our telecom customers that I speak to, what would your end customers say about your network? Would they say it's reliable? Would they say that you protect their assets? Would they say that they have high quality of experiences? And if they say yes to all of those, then the bottom line is that in order to do all of that for your end customers, you have to be data-driven. You have to have a well-established service assurance plan. The solution is really to have a consistent tool set across architects and operators that uh, automates and allows you to operate your network across the entire life cycle, day zero, day one, day two plus, so that when you make changes as an operator, you're making them at the intent level. You're changing the intent for the network.